live from the AV room at Overland Park High School, it's the Trisha Show, featuring Trisha. Today's guest is Lindsay Sign. I'm Trisha, and here's Trisha. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Welcome to the show, everybody, and welcome, Lindsay. Hi, thank you. Hi. So, you're in the new movie Insidious 2. Is that going to be as scary as it looks? Yes. It is terrifying, I think. Uh, James Wan, the director, is pretty much the master of the genre. So question on the table. Lindsay, we'll start with you. Do you like scary movies? Um, as an audience member, I am a pretty big chicken. Mmm. Mm. Yum. I pretty much cover my eyes the whole time, so I've definitely heard a lot more scary movies than I've seen. Oh, I can totally relate to that. I actually did that with like, do you remember this really scary movie? Do you remember it was called uh, Milo and Otis? Scariest movie ever. Yeah. A dog, friends with a cat, no way. No, those are boundaries that aren't meant to be crossed. Um, That's nature against nature. The sequel, Homeward Bound, terrifying. All right, back to you, Lindsay. What's your favorite scary movie? Yeah. The scariest movie I've seen recently was The Conjuring, which was also directed by James Wan, who directed Insidious 2. And I think the reason that movie was so scary and messed up was it's based on a real story. It's these were real people. Mm -hmm. And so the whole time you're watching it, you're like, oh, my God, like this actually happened to people. People actually went through this. Oh, my God. James Wan did that to those people. That guy's sick. He's a monster. That guy's like, like ill sick. Hey, Trisha, what scares you the most? Vegetables. Which is your scariest vegetable? <gasps> Count of three. One, One two, two, three. three. Kumquat. <gasps> What's a kumquat? Nobody knows, and that's why it's so scary. <laughs> oh my gosh, Lindsay, scariest vegetable? Lima beans. Mmm. Oh, oh, you can't mix that with anything. <laughs> no. Trisha, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Definitely. <laughs> Trisha, Trisha lightning, lightning round. round. Okay, Lindsay, we're gonna give you two things, and you're gonna tell us which one is scarier. Okay. All right, floodlighting or neon clocks? Floodlighting. Okay, water bottle or small child giving you a thumbs up? Small children. Um, handball or kids who bite their nails? Ooh, nails, gross. Rockstar energy drink or your mom's nostril? Mountain Dew. Um, painting a house or ordering Taco Bell? <laughs> Taco Bell. <laughs> okay, Gary Sinise or Gary Sinise's niece? Uh, Gary Coleman. HDMI or Apple Pie? HDMI. Fredericks of Hollywood or Drop Dead Fred? Drop Dead Fred. Uh, Snow cones or sneezing? (laughs) Sneezing. Underage drinking or older age drinking? It's all scary. Being stuck in traffic and you have no AC and it's really hot outside and you're already late for something or AIDS? Wow, Trisha, those both sound pretty terrible. Okay, your mom being really, really mad at you and putting her hands on her hips and saying your full name, including your middle name, or AIDS? Again, both bad options. A geologist hike or a really old-timey guy saying, Hey, take a hike. <laughs> old-timey guy. All right, great job, Lindsay. Trisha, what's her score? Uh, we don't keep score. Yeah, you win. Yay! Yay! Yeah. Lindsay, do you scare easily? Yes, I'm a very easy scare. It's kind of pathetic. I will go fetal, like, at the drop of a hat and crumple into a ball. Okay, did that scare you? <laughs> not maybe, no. I mean, not in this context, but... How about... No, not so much. I'm not an really. apple. I'm an apple. I'm a grape now. I am a different fruit. No? <laughs> What are you? Who are you? Oh no, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to scare you. That chilled me like a cooler. Ooh. Um. Okay. We should. Uh, we should. Keep, um. Lindsay. Sorry. That was. Uh. We're getting a little off topic. Another question on the table. Do we believe in ghosts? Oh yeah, I do. If she does, I do. I mean, I thought I saw a ghost once, <gasps> but then it turned out to be a racist guy. I want to come back as like a sexy ghost. So people are like, look at that ghost. She's so hot. I wish she weren't like a ghost. I want to come back as Patrick Swayze. (gasps) Let's get back to your movie. Yeah. Okay. So what do you play? I play uh, the younger version of Lynn Shay's character from the first movie. She was a medium. And so I play her in flashback. Oh, a medium. I'm a small. I'm an extra small, but a small if I pad. Uh, Trisha, we're totally going to see Insidious too. 
Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yes. But will you, you sit to next hold, to me? You will you hold my hand? Um yeah. Um totally peanut butter. So when does it premiere? September thirteenth, it opens. <gasps> oh, Friday the thirteenth. Oh my gosh, that's my favorite day of the year. Oh I, that's bad luck. Oh. It is? Yeah. I thought it was like super best luck. All right, well, that's all the time we have for today. Everybody go see Insidious 2, which opens tomorrow night, Mom. Friday the 13th. Woo-hoo. Thank you so much for Lindsay Syme for coming by. Thanks, Lindsay. Thanks, girls. We'll see you guys next time. We'll see you guys next time. Hi, everybody. Thank you so much for watching The Trisha Show. And special thanks to Lindsay Syme for coming by. If you want to find out more information about her, her website is below in the information box. You can also follow her on Twitter. So follow her! Yay! And don't forget, go see Insidious Chapter 2 on September 13th. Friday the 13th. (laughs) And for more MPGIS stuff, click down here. Thanks for watching, guys! Bye. Bye! Bye!